Hello everybody! In order to run something like Grand, we need something what is called Node.js. But why? Why is that so? Well, let's look at the Grand. It is the JavaScript task runner. So it means that I have to every time open my web browser in order to run it. Well, it wouldn't be good if we had to do something like that each time, right? We want it to operate on our system outside of the browser. And hello, we have got something like Node.js and is a platform, it's some kind of environment which is used to run applications that are written in the JavaScript outside of the browser, okay? So this is this thing and we need to download it. So we go to the download section and here we are going to install the one that we need for so for example it is the Windows installer MSI so I'm taking these things 64 bits I'm clicking it here I am saving and I'm downloading it right you should of course uh, choose the Linux or Macintosh it all depends on your system okay so let's open it let's execute it and let's install it so we are clicking next we are reading the terms pretty carefully we accept it next next and we shouldn't opt out of anything here because it's really important to have all these things here. We are clicking next, install, and then we are waiting. Okay, so we have finished installing it. We click finish. And right now we have got something what is called NPM, which stands for a node package model, which can, let's see what it can do, which as you can see is used for managing packages that are used inside a node, right? Inside this environment. So look, there are many of them. You can follow, you can read about others, but well, the most important for us right now is something what is called Grant, right? Because this is the course about Grant. And this is one of the package that can be run outside of web browser, right? We don't need web browser to run it because of the node that we have just installed. Okay, so let's install this thing here. How to do it? Let's open this thing here. As you can see, in order to install it, we have to use the terminal or the console. It all depends on your system. In, uh, in order to do it in the Windows, we just click here and then we type something like CMD or I, I use the shortcut Windows key plus R and here we type the CMD I click OK and now here we can install it. I will use the Ctrl plus C, then I will paste it here and I'll just click enter. And right now we are installing the Grand CLI. If it doesn't work, it means that you did something wrong with this, then uh, with installing Node.js, you should install it again, maybe with the uh, right privileges. It all depends on your system. But well, as you can see, now everything works. We have uh, just uh, we have just inserted the Grand CLI, and this thing here, the G, means that we have installed it with uh, being able to use the Grand command everywhere, which will make it easier to use for us. So, well, in the next lesson, we'll learn how to configure the Grand inside our project. Okay, that's all in that lesson. Thank you very much.